What's going on, everybody? K Kim here. I'm coming at you guys with a very nice gameplay here today. I drop a 50 bomb. Unfortunately, it's in a pub though, so it's I mean it's not all that special. Um, so there's like six people against six people, and we somehow end up getting a trip cap in this. And I don't see how that's possible because getting a trip cap against six people seems pretty tough, especially on a map like Sovereign where you literally spawn on the flag. But anyways, what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is my new partnership on YouTube and. Uh, my or the SSK gaming. I wanted to update you guys on SSK and give you guys like the full roster of SSK gaming from like SSK gaming, SSK pubs, and just everything that's going around at SSK gaming. Uh, but I'm gonna start out with my new partnership on YouTube. So I partnered with the Freedom Network. Um, they're pretty decent network. They're like ranked twelfth all time. And they actually give you a full week of XSplit too, so it's pretty nice. And they've got like lots of tips videos, and it's a really great network. And I signed, I applied for it. They accepted me, and now I'm a partner with them. And I can leave at any time if I ever get like a better offer from like Machinima or something, which is likely not happening in the near future. But just in case it does, I am allowed to leave, and the longer I stay, the more money I make, so, like, the more percentage I have, and, wow, I just got wrecked with that butter knife there. But here, we actually end up taking the trip cap, I just thought I should point that out. But, um, with Freedom, I get a free week of XSplit, and then if I make a review on XSplit, then... I get another four weeks, so that's like five full weeks, and if I raise my revenue by like five dollars, I can pay for a full month of XSplit and just keep doing that as long as I make five dollars a month, then I basically have XSplit for free. So that's pretty nice, you know, I'm looking forward to this, and it's going to be nice actually having a partnership and stuff on YouTube, so any monetized views I get, so like any views I get. They like any views in the month of July. I get paid on September 30th, so like it's what a three month delay, and I get paid. But once it hits September 30th, I actually will get paid every month because then I have my August views, my September views, and so on. It'll just keep going on and on after September 30th. So I don't get my first actual pay until September 30th, but then after that, I get paid monthly. So it's a great opportunity for me. I think it's really helpful for me from a creator standpoint because it's going to help me make greater videos for you guys. And they're going to give me lots of tips on how to become great. And I want to actually start making great videos. Like I want to edit and everything. And I want to bring you guys the best content possible because, you know, that, then why would I be doing this if I didn't want to do that? I mean, it's not like I'm sharing these with myself. I'm sharing these for all you guys watching this. So, yeah, that's my partnership, and now I want to update you guys about SSK Gaming and SSK Pubs. Um, currently, the roster on SSK Gaming is myself, Nitro, Huntsman, and Maniac. We got Maniac. He's probably, like, he's more of a support SMG, so, like, he's kind of, like, supporting the objective role and just, you know, trying to help Huntsman get those flags, which Huntsman is Huntsman is the objective player, and he's actually pretty good at it. Uh, Nitro's an AR role, which he's really good at. He's dropping numbers similar to me, but the only thing holding him back is internet and stuff, which can get really frustrating because he literally timed out of every match yesterday, but then again, he had to move his setup because he was getting yelled at by the people in his house saying that he was too loud <laughs> because his game room's literally right next to their bedroom. So, yeah, um, then Maniac, you know, support SMG, I actually already said that, Huntsman, OBJ, Nitro, AR, and then you've got me, this the SMG Slayer, which I just literally go all out and try and drop three dead, four dead, so that my teammates can be hopping on those objectives, and I actually do hop on objectives too, but, I mean, I'm not, like, that's not the first thing I think about, like, if there's four people up, I'm not hopping on that flag. If there's four people up, I'm going to try and maybe take out two or three and then hop on the flag. You know, I'm just, I might just, like, sit the flag and wait for someone to hop on it just so I can kill them off of it. So, yeah, that's, I actually rely on my accuracy a lot for this role. So, I make sure that my aim is on. On this gameplay, my accuracy isn't all that great. I don't know what happened. I guess it's just because I've been playing on Xbox One so much lately for this tournament coming up on Saturday. But, yeah, I want to make you guys the best content possible and... 
SSK Gaming is looking really good. But then there's SSK Pubs, and the only person on SSK Pubs right now is SSK Jeremy. And he's been there for quite some time. I don't... I, John is not on SSK Pubs. I'm going to get to that in a little bit real quick. Um, what we're actually doing with SSK is we are making a second team. We are going to have the main roster of myself, Maniac, Huntsman, and Nitro. Then we're also making an SSK Youth or whatever we want to call it. Currently it's SSK Youth. We might switch the name, but that's got John on it, and he is trying to find three other players to play with him on SSK Youth. And then we have two different teams. And, I mean, I'd, I don't know if it'd be more of a rivalry or a ally. I mean, I guess it's an ally because it's an SSK, but it could be a rivalry because they want to prove who the superior team in SSK is. So I think that that's going to be very interesting that we've got two teams now, and I'm really looking forward to seeing John get three teammates of his own. I mean, obviously we couldn't team together because he was having a lot of issues with the team, but now he's got his, he's going to have his own team, so we'll see how that works out, and hopefully it works out pretty well. So... We now have those two teams on SSK Pubs, and I've got my partnership. And I also wanted to talk to you guys about some sponsors real quick. Um, I got sponsored by Cinch Gaming. You can use the coupon code KCAM. I already said that in the video. Um, but you guys can use that coupon code for 5% off, and it gives me five sponsorship points. And with five sponsorship points, it helps me further your entertainment by being able to get better at Call of Duty because at 40 I get a PS3 cinch which is what I'm this video is on PS3 but I'm also looking to play on Xbox One a lot now that I got that and I also have gills for it so I'm looking to get some gameplays on that and also um, I've got so like yeah 50 points I get the cinch one um, so just keep on using my coupon codes guys and I would appreciate that greatly like arms wide this great like as wide as I go like 20 foot wingspan this much so that's how much I appreciate anybody that uses the code and just pretty much all my fans in general because you guys are pretty great all the people that come out to my streams and stuff which I always have that link down in the description and now that I have XSplit it's going to be fun using that so yeah I'm I hope you guys are enjoying the streams too because now that I'm actually using that, you can hear the whole team. And that's how I'm getting my GB gameplays. And I'm sorry about that Strike Zone Dom game that I posted the other day. I know that it was really laggy. That's because I was using OBS and my computer is, was slow. So it was like freezing all the time. Now that I have XSplit, I can actually use my capture card to record it. So it's not going to be all laggy like it was. And I feel like I'm just watching the same exact thing over and over again. I don't know why. I don't think I am, but it looks like it a lot. I don't know. It maybe it feels like deja vu, but I mean, score obviously it's new, but whatever. I'm getting off topic. Um, so I already talked about the two SSK teams, and I also wanted to talk to you guys about something that we are going to be starting up doing next Monday, I believe. Maybe even Sunday, but most likely next Monday. We are going to be playing some wager matches. We haven't played those yet. We've just been scrimming it up on GB and stuff, making sure that our team is good enough to actually play money matches and money eights and stuff. So we are going to be playing wager matches, which if you don't know what that is, then it's UMG matches on the UMGgaming.com site where you post a match, but instead of just posting it like a GB, you'd post it and you could say how much money you want it for, like $2.50 each. $50 each, uh, I think 50 is the highest you can go, but yeah, actually this gameplay is re replaying itself over, what the heck, I feel like I've already watched this once already, I don't even know, I maybe it's, I don't think it'll show up in the video, I probably must like accidentally click something, <laughs> like fast forward it and then it went back, actually no, never mind, no, I watched this once already, dude, I feel so dumb now, alright, just, just don't even mind me, um, so I apologize for going off topic right there. I feel stupid because I just literally watched this whole gameplay before recording this. So it kind of confused me, but I'm good now. But yeah, we hope to play wager matches soon. And then after wager matches, we're going to try and make enough money to get GB credits. And with GB credits, we're going to want to play in some tournaments. 
And so if there's like not a tournament up and we've got extra GB credits, we might ask someone to play with us and we'll just like either transfer him credits or hopefully he can buy himself credits because I like having money and I don't like giving it away unless it's me buying something that I really want and I really want a tournament because, I mean, I just think that the tournament atmosphere is a fun place to be. Like, I mean, I don't really care all that much about playing in like a season match. Like, on Michigan Esports, they've got, like, leagues and stuff. And so, I don't, I mean, yeah, I like qualifying for the tournament and stuff, but I like playing more when there's stuff on the line, and it's not just us playing to practice. So, there you guys go. I got 51 and tournament on Saturday, a 2v2, and then I also want to play some tournaments and wagers with SSK Gaming, because I think that that would be very enjoyable to bring you guys some gameplays of us winning tournament matches and playing in tournaments. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This has been KKM10, and I will see you guys all later. Goodbye.